de hablar con el presidente y CEO de Volvo aquí en Norteamérica, Tony Nicolosi. Vamos a hablar con Jan Eric Larsen, el jefe de ingenieros que ha desarrollado, como decíamos, la estrategia de Volvo, que es muy novedosa porque van a eliminar todos los modelos eh, con motores V6 y V8 y van a concentrarse en fabricar modelos con motores de cuatro cilindros con turbocargadores y supercargadores. So now we are here with the chief engineer for the engines, uh, and the engines is the, the big new story for Volvo, uh, basically since the company has a, has a clean start, right? Yes. Can so, you tell us about it? The, the four cylinders and... Yeah, gonna... that, what is amazing with this new uh, engines from, from Volvo is that we have only four cylinders, only two liters, and we different the, the performance of the engine by the charging system. So, for instance, the new T6 engine will have a supercharger and a turbocharger in combination, while the T5 engine will only have a turbocharger. And the T6 will start at uh, 302 horsepower, and the T5 will have 240 horsepower. Yeah, and then I understand you can do many variants of these engines, like you can put a hybrid, a plug-in hybrid, and smaller output, and, 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 and things like that. It's like... a Very yes. high-end Lego <laughs> Lego system, right? Exactly. Uh, that that have been a part of the program to sort of having a plug and play. So you start up with a only combustion engine. You can have a crank ISD. It's prepared for that, and it's prepared for a hybrid only, and also for a plug-in hybrid. So everything is matching together, you can say. Yeah. So in the future platform, the spa platform, uh, scalable uh, product architecture. Uh, we will have a plug-in hybrid. And, and so that's like, uh, at, at least the, the, the immediate future for Volvo, it's going to be for four-cylinder engines. Exactly. So out with the six, out with the eight, but some people don't realize how powerful these engines can be, right? You can, uh, the, I guess in the Formula One back in the day, they were like 900 horsepower four-cylinder engines. Yeah, but, I mean, many people have, have uh, been, have, question if, if this is the right strategy but as soon as we get you in the car or the customer into the car so you were right <laughs> they, 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 they think they, they actually experience that the car uh, perform very very well yeah so now we have the S60 and now the V60 so like two very different cars in a, in a way I mean like the looks of it and all that but then the, the output of it like it's a small engine and but like the performance is really really good the performance is extraordinary I would say Yeah, and so tell us a little bit about because Volvo. I mean, it's like river, restarting again with everything since the sold from uh, Ford. Uh, you're not a big company compared to, let's say, Porsche or Volkswagen or or General no, that, Motors, that but is, you have like really good engineers. Yeah, that is correct, and and also it's 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 sometimes it's actually beneficial to be small yeah. because you can take a quick decision, you can move fast. And you don't have a huge management to to sort of um, uh, approve things. And exactly. Yeah. So 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 it's it can sometimes it can be much much easier. Yeah. How big is your team, for example, the, the team that works for this the project? Pow the powertrain team is roughly a, around thousand guys. A thousand. Yeah. Well, that's still a lot. <laughs> yeah. In Europe, they already have the plug-in hybrid, right? Yeah, for diesels, we have plug-in hybrid. Yeah. So that in, in, in the i5Ds. I yeah. Excellent. Well, thank you very much for your time, and uh, we're really enjoying the, the cars. Unfortunately, here in Las Vegas, where we're driving, the speed limit is kind of low, so we can enjoy as much as we could. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Okay, thank you.